हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल फिजिक्स बॉय आई एम सॉल्विंग जेस 2017 फिजिक्स पेपर आई विल अपलोड ऑल फिजिक्स क्वेश्चंस वन बाय वन एंड नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस आइसोएंट्रोपिक एक्सपेंशन प्रॉब्लम ऑफ स्टैटिस्टिकल मैकेनिक्स फ्रॉम पार्ट बी जेस 2017 द क्वेश्चन वाज Suppose that the number of microstates available to a system of n particles depends on n and the combined variable u v square where u is the internal energy and v is the volume of the system the system initially has volume 2 meter cube and energy 200 joule it undergoes an isoentropic expansion to volume 4 meter cube what is the final pressure of the system in si units in this problem it is given that the number of microstates available to this system depends on number of particles n and the combined variable u v square so we can write the number of microstate omega is equal to some proportional constant times n u v square and you know for isoentropic process s is equal to constant so change of entropy that is ds is equal to 0 for isoentropic process on the other hand for thermodynamics you know du is equal to tds minus pdv for this system ds is equal to 0 so du is equal to minus pdv so p is equal to minus del u del v at constant s okay now you have the relation between entropy s and the total number of microstate which is look like this where s is the entropy s equal to kb times natural logarithm of omega where kb is the boltzmann constant now in this relation s is constant and omega is alpha n u v square as left hand side of this equation is constant so right hand side must be constant so yeah, alpha n u v square is equal to constant again alpha is the proportional constant and n is constant for this system so u v square is equal to some another constant i will come back to this relation very soon before that let's see what data is given in this problem initially we have u1 that is internal energy is equal to 200 joule and volume is 2 meter cube and n is the number of particles that is constant as this system undergoes isoentropic expansion and volume of this system increases to 4 meter cube but number of particle n remains same now come back to the previous relation that is u v square is equal to constant let us assume this constant is equal to c so u1 v1 square is equal to c now by putting the value of u1 that is initial internal energy which is equal to 200 and initial volume that is equal to 2 meter cube we get c is equal to 800 so we get the relation between u and v during this isoentropic process which is u v square is equal to 800 so u can be written as 800 by v square now differentiating this with respect to volume we get minus 1600 divided by v cube now pressure can be written as minus del u del v at constant s so by putting the value of del u del v we get pressure is equal to 1600 by v cube so pressure is a function of volume when volume becomes 4 meter cube then pressure becomes 1600 divided by 4 cube which is equal to 1600 divided by 64 equal to 25 for this question you must be answered by integers of four digits in gst exam so the answer is 0025 if you have any other query then feel free to write me by commenting on my video this video is helpful then please share it to any physics related social media group we will upload remaining questions by one within few hours so stay tuned with us subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button and click the bell icon to enjoy the latest uploads from our channel